Hello, beautiful. Oh, Nat. I love when you surprise me at work. It's so cute. Meow. Guess the cat doesn't think so. So, what are you doing here? We're going on a date night. Really? Cool. Where? It's a surprise. I can't tell you. All right. Oh, Andrew, you scared me. I'm not used to seeing you here at work. I know, I know, but like, I think we're kind of, you know, at a stage where we're for sure catching feelings and I want to take you on a date, like a special little date, just the two of us. That is so sweet. Let me grab my things. So what you're telling me is you're going to blindfold me, put me in my own car, but in the passenger seat, and you're going to drive me somewhere and I don't know where we're going? Yeah, Olivia, but it's a date night. What are you worried about? I'm gonna like kidnap you or something? I could have done that a long time ago, but I'm not gonna. Don't get worried. I know, I know. It's just weird. Like, I don't know, but let's go. I'm kind of excited. Surprise. Aw, you're so cute. Are you eating at the cafe again? Yeah, why? What do you mean again? We haven't been here in two weeks. I know, I know. I just thought maybe you had like something a little bit special or planned because it's almost Valentine's Day. Hey, 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 don't judge. When Valentine's Day comes, I have my ways, and I'm sure you do too. All right, all right, I'm starving, let's just go. Andrew, you shockingly know me so well already. A picnic by Heart Lake, by the flowing river. On a Saturday night, you're so precious. Of course, I mean, I would love coming here too. It's gorgeous around here. I know, let's sit. And we're off. All right, kiddos, you can sit down and I'll come take your order, okay? Okay. Alrighty, what can I do you for? Um, I'll have a burger and some water. Okay, you stay. Um, I want a turkey club sandwich with fries and a coffee. Sounds good, be right up. I'm having so much fun with you. Me too. Not to intrude or anything, but you guys are like so adorable together. Like, why aren't you dating? Hey, Emma, come here a sec. You like just totally ruined my big surprise plan. This whole night out with Mia, I planned on asking her out after the date. Oh shoot, okay, sorry, I'll just go back to work. It's fine, I guess. I just hope she doesn't suspect anything now. I really hope he asks me out. We've liked each other for so long. Sorry about that. Back to dinner, cutie. Okay, where are we, Olivia? Steven! No way! Wow, this is really bringing back all the feels right now. This is where we first met, where I had a huge heartbreak. So many things happened in this little town. What are we doing here? Well, yeah, it's where we first met, so yeah, it's pretty important to me, and I wanted to ice skate with you and just reminisce a little bit. That is so sweet. Let's go. It looks like we got the place to ourselves. Well, yeah, bedtime in this town is pretty early. Steven, you're so thoughtful. If you did this for just one regular old date night, I wonder what you're gonna do for our Valentine's Day together this year. You'll see, you'll see. Don't question my methods. Here you go, kids. Eat up. Thanks, Marie. No problem. You need anything else, I'm by the register. This food is so good. Sorry if it seemed like I was complaining before. No, not at all. I know what you want for dessert, though. Say it, say it. Chocolate cream pie? Yes, of course. I see one in the glass case already. Anything for you. Thank you. Good thing we decided to take a walk. I sure ate a lot of sandwiches tonight. <laughs> Not as many croissants as I had. So, so, Mia, Andrew, I have a question to ask you. Will you be my official girlfriend? Absolutely. I've been waiting for what feels like forever for you to ask me that, Andrew. You're such a sweetie. You too. Mwah. Uh, nothing's more exciting than a fresh new budding romance. Ugh, kind of jealous. What a beautiful night out. Now we get to watch the sunset together. Thanks again, Steven. Of course, Olivia. This has been a lot of fun. It proved to me that my feelings for you was just as real then as they are now. Same. This was so meant to be. I wonder what would have happened if I never made it to this little town that year. I don't want to think about that. My life is pretty perfect with you right now. Me too. 
I'm pretty tired though. You ready to head back to Heart Lake? Yeah, but definitely we need to come back here real soon. I agree. Good night, my love. Good night, my beautiful girlfriend. I'm so full. Don't you regret getting this pie? No, absolutely not. I might not have been able to eat a lot of it, but that doesn't mean I can't take it home and devour it at midnight, can I? <laughs> You're so crazy, but funny. And I love you. I love you too. Let's get going though. I'm kind of tired from all this eating. I feel ya. Thanks, Marie. Nothing is better than your cooking, girl. Oh, y'all are so cute. Thanks, see you again soon. Bye. What a great little night out. Right? I know. I'm so sad this night has to come to an end, Andrew, but thanks for making it really special. Of course, I mean, I have a girlfriend. I have a boyfriend. Now we gotta go tell people and post about it. We have a lot to do. Let's go. Thanks for watching today's cute little episode of Lego Friends to kick off the Valentine's Day and love season for 2020. So comment any video ideas you guys may have down below in order to win shoutouts. Like this video, subscribe for more cool videos coming soon, and watch all my other videos in the meantime. See you in the next one.